10-year honeymoon trip around the world. Yep, and right now we are in Ban Xiang Long, which is close to Mandalay, and we are going to see a very special friend who loves these. <laughs> yep. Our special friend lives here in the temple. Um, for now, only lives here right now. But I'm going to go and see her without Soka because, um, well, you understand why. You can maybe hear her coming up now. Hey, baby girl. And are you ready? Hey girl. Hello. How are you? What's this? What is this? Okay. Here we go. Hey baby. Hey you. Oh yeah. yeah. Hey baby, how are you? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, sweetie. These guys are best friends. Yeah, we are. We are not sure of the story of how she got here, but we heard that um, when the railway station was being built in Lang Prabang, a guy from China brought this monkey. He gave it to a village woman who didn't know what to do with it, so she gave her to the temple to look after. And now she's here. And Michael from Mandalau, Along with us, we are trying to get her to free the bear sanctuary where they have a, a rehabilitation program to take macaques Ooh. into the wild with families. So right now there's no space, so she has to stay for a little bit longer. But while she waits, we are here to keep her company and yeah. we come and visit her every day. Yeah, we usually for around two hours we bring her some bananas, cucumber, which is our favorite, but we couldn't bring cucumber. that today. Love cucumber. And we give her water and you're happy, huh? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, sorry. So usually the first, usually the first stop is to get water for her. That didn't quite go to plan. Oh This is one of her favorite places as it's full of um, blackberries and she loves them. Usually her mouth and little uh, hands are purple from the berries. Oh. The only thing she's not very good at is sharing. Hey baby. She's actually very smart. She can untangle herself so she's up in the trees. She knows to go back the same way and to wait until it's it's loose. So, uh, but usually she doesn't that do that. Usually she likes to give us a little challenge, and she just like wraps herself around the trees, and then we have to climb the trees to like get her free. So we'll yeah. show you that later. It's a we'll lot of fun. Hey baby, hey baby. And this is how our time consists. We just sit around and let her do her thing, whether it's sitting eating some flowers, climbing trees. Just try to let her do what she wants to do. Gone. Oh, and claiming as well. Oh, there's a tomacha in there. Yes. Oh. You always have to be ready. And she knows where they hide all the sticky rice. What is it you're looking for? Yes. Yeah. Yummy. Okay, we're 
you're so good. Go, go, go. Oh, I thought you were going to hold hands with this. Oh, that would be cute. Okay, <gasps> going to the river. <laughs> She's also a very good thief. Sometimes she goes in here and then <laughs> she just like steals something very sneaky. This is one of our favorite spots in the village because from here, Mandalao is like over there and the elephants usually stay over here and because they're kind of free to, to do what they like, sometimes the elephants come down to bathe in the river. Um, and yeah, we actually happened one of the times we were having a swim here. And just across the river, there's an elephant just in the water plane. So, um, should we go yeah. for a swim? Maybe. What do you think, baby girl? You want to go for a swim? First time we brought her to the river, we didn't want to force her to do anything, so we just sat, sat her on the shoulder and. <laughs> she makes a decision about whether she wanted to go in or not. Last time she decided to go in. <laughs> when monkeys become wet, they become super smelly. But luckily, it's only for the time that they're wet after they're okay. <laughs> Whenever she doesn't want her food, the trick is you take her food, you bite apart. Then she wants it. Then she will take it. Sand. <laughs> She saw a banana! <laughs> what happened? Wow! That was like as much as she could fit in her mouth. Once she finds something that she loves to do, she just repeats it over and over again. She goes, tree, us, tree, us, tree, us. It's crazy. Okay, again. That was not such a good job. <laughs> What you can see is that her cheeks just fill up with rice. Opa. 
the first time we saw it, we thought she had an abscess or something. We're like, oh my god, this is not normal. But if you see, oh, her little cheeks fell up here with rays. <laughs> Inspection time. <laughs> and earrings. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Not my eyebrows. Ah, I could feel that. <laughs> She gets serious at doing that. She's like, don't put me out of concentration. I have to finish this. This is important work. Ow. So I think that may be all we have time for. We're gonna chill out for a little bit mm. longer and then we're gonna head back to Mandala. Sometimes we sail in the evening and then she just falls asleep in my arms and We've got some we've got some footage of that yeah. for you. But um, yeah, so this is our friend Baby Gero and um we're hoping that she will be released soon. Um I don't know if we, we didn't really explain but she can't be released just from here because she doesn't have a community of monkeys, it's not safe. Um she wouldn't survive in the wild. So we are waiting for Free the Bears to have some space in their mm -hmm. macaque pro program and then yeah hopefully they can take her within the next month and um, get her into a family and then reintroduce her into the world. Yeah, for now we're showing her, showing her some love. Yeah, so if you enjoyed this, this video, if you want to see more videos like this, maybe more from this beautiful little girl, like, subscribe, turn on the notification bell, all that good stuff mm -hmm. and yeah, we we'll will see you in the next, in the next adventure. adventure. Have a wonderful time. Goodbye. Whoop.